Hello, this is Robert Smith. I'm in Gruyere, Switzerland. And, um, I was talking to um, several people about tapping and why someone can tap for nine months and get no results. And of course, we talk about how our minds work because um, our mind is really a hypnosis machine or a trance machine. Basically, when you start thinking about a problem, what happens? Well, you think about it, you go into it, you feel as if you're there, you're in the trance. Uh, the problem with that is, is that oftentimes when you go into your problem or your trance, you go in and you don't get out. That means you stay in. That means you're actually rehearsing the problem and also making the problem bigger by rehearsing it. So uh, the deal is, is, is aiming at the internal representation, what you're doing inside yourself. Because, you know, I started out with EFT and before that studying NLP and then bringing NLP into the EFT and then creating faster EFT. But um, with EFT, they said focus on the problem, hold on to the problem, and then tap. Well, the problem is, is that you're holding on to the problem. And the problem is, is that when people are tapping, they're going into the emotional state and they go in and they stay in it and they feel it and not actually get their way out of it. There's a process that I created called defractionation, which is basically when you go into your trance, you pull yourself out of the trance and then you tap on what was in the trance, um, which is the key, is to destroy the unconscious programming of that hypnotic state, the trance of miserableness, whatever it is that you're doing. That's why some people can tap and never get any results because they keep rehearsing what they're trying to get rid of instead of going in, noticing and pulling out. Now another problem that I see with people who are tapping is they have a problem and it pops up and they start tapping and what they're using is tapping as an escapism or escape-aholic to avoid feelings. Now with Faster T, we don't avoid the feelings. We actually welcome them. We identify them. We associate to them. Then we let them go. We come out of the trance and we release whatever it is the trance holds. So these are two big major mistakes that people will make and they could tap for years and never get any results because they don't understand the process of, of the Faster T style and also the process of problems. Because when you have a problem, you go into trance. Sometimes you go into the trance, you tap your way out of the trance, but the key is, is when you're aiming, you aim at something, you welcome it, you notice it, and then you pull yourself out of it and you tap it. That means you change the meaning, change the representation, change how you feel it, change how you see it, change how you hear it until it's not there. And then you go back and check and make sure it's gone. As I mentioned before, some people are just using tapping to escape, not to feel their emotions and feelings, which is another big mistake. We associate, we feel it, we know it, and we let it go. Those are two major areas that, that people are mis making mistake in. Now, oftentimes, you know, most people... I mean, they can, it, they can still, it'll still work with them anyway, but some people are really good at deep trances, deep problems, and it takes them a while to come out of it. So these are two great ways. So the most important thing is, is, to, is aiming, noticing, associating, releasing, coming out of it, releasing, go back into it, double check, do it over and over and over again until you pass out or until it's gone. That is a joke. You don't really have to pass out, but you do have to make sure you're persistently getting rid of whatever it is that you need to get rid of, change. So persistence is your most powerful tool that you have in your tool belt. Keep doing it until you get the results. Anyway, this is Robert Smith here in Kuya, Kuya, Switzerland. This is Robert Smith in Kuya, Switzerland. And I always find cool places like this place right here. There's a castle behind me, beautiful scenery. I will show you that great place to be tapping on yourself find places to tap on yourself and if you can't do it in public go to the bathroom shut the stall door and tap until it's gone yeah. this is robert smith ciao